Hi, if you don't know me, my name is Dylan LeMay. I'm mainly known for making ice cream and all kinds of other weird things, but today we're playing some video games together. I know what you're thinking. This is such an, a weird, obscure game for me to play with you guys, but it'll make sense in a few minutes. You'll understand. First, I'm absolutely terrible when it comes to video games. Like, I cannot play a first-person shooter to save my life. But, you know, now that I think about it, this kind of is a first-person shooter. Instead of shooting bullets at people, you're actually just shooting shots of Pokemon. So, I'm kind of playing a first-person shooter. So, you're going to see why I'm bad. I'm just not good with controls. I have no, like, response time. It's, it's pretty bad. The thing is, I've gotten a lot better, so I used to be way worse. So imagine me as a kid. So Pokemon was always my favorite game as a kid because it's turn-based, so it's just like you're playing a board game. You don't have to have a reaction time. But the thing is, you have to have strategy. So I know some of you are going to hate on it and say Pokemon's a kid's game, which I get that. The story is very childish and usually takes way too long, but when it comes to battling your friends, it's like the most complicated, layered version of chess. I think it's a ton of fun. My sophomore year of college, me and a group of my friends were all just sitting around talking and realized that we all grew up playing Pokemon. Then one of us realized that they were pretty much remastering our favorite game. So we decided to all go out and buy DSs that night and all get the new game. Which if you were wondering, yes, that was a terrible idea because we were college students and we didn't have free time to just sit around and play games, but we did it. And we did it a lot. But it was so much fun because then we split up in teams, we'd do like team battles. It was just a ton of fun. But all of those friends are pretty much married now and I'm just chilling by myself. So you guys need to be a new friends. We're going to play all these games together <laughs> instead of me playing with them. I purposely made sure that I did not look up anything about these games because I want to be fresh and I want us just to have fun and learn together. But I have to ask you a question because we need to talk about this right now. Do you say Pokemon, Pokemon, or Pokemon? I find myself saying Pokemon more than I should, but in reality, it's not Pokemon, it's not Pokemon, it's Pokemon. Look it up. Just like Beyonce, it's Poke. Pokemon, yeah. Hopefully, I'll get to figure out soon what actually makes a good picture in this game, because I kind of have no idea what I'm doing. I'm just taking a wild guess. And I have a feeling he's just going to say they're all one-star photos. And that's going to be it. If you made it this far and you want to throw out some suggestions on stuff that you would like me to play in the future, I am 100% open to going and buying some game. Even if it's something funny that you think would just be hilarious to watch me play. Because like I said, it's I'm not the best at games, guys. It's, it'll be pretty funny. I have friends that legitimately invite me over just to give me a game to watch me play it because I think it's funny to watch me struggle. So if you want to see me play something else, just throw out some things. I only have uh, a Switch right now, but I can always just buy a different game system if it's really that big of a deal and this is really doing well i'm open to whatever i love how they actually like interact with each other it's pretty cool to see like the pokemon interacting and doing things like as if it was real because you only see that in the anime the video games usually are pretty kind of dull when it comes to that kind of side of this if you haven't heard from the 3000 other times i've said this but my favorite pokemon's mudkip and i'm pretty sad because i'm pretty sure he's not in this game but there are tons of other pokemon in here one thing that's so funny about Pokemon is as a kid, my mom would always justify letting me play it because she said it would help me learn to read. And as a kid, I was terrible at reading to the point where I had to go to special tutors to teach me to read because I was just struggled. I My teacher in second grade had to go out and buy books for me because I couldn't read the books that they already owned. But I'm saying all of that to let you know that I'm probably going to screw up some of these names on these Pokemon because I've just read them and created up a little story in my head of what they should sound like but in reality they may be completely different so if i pronounce anything funny let me know like this is florgis and i know that if you take a picture with other pokemon in it in the old game it would give you more like points so i'm thinking that that should do well but once again i have no idea what's going to help me do well and what's going to give me good points but we're going to keep trying and figure this out let me know in the comments below what picture you think is going to do the best because i'm curious i have no idea I'm not crazy, like this game started glitching out with all these Pokemon around, right? It's like going really slow, it's like slow motion. I think it's because all these Pokemon in the game can't process it, which shouldn't be a problem, but I don't know. Pokemon usually struggles with stuff like this, it's really sad, it's a super old company, but sometimes their games just glitch out, it's weird. Finally, the moment we've been waiting for, we get to figure out what is considered a good photo and what's considered a bad photo. So let's figure out what Professor Mirror has to say. That's a weird name. Normally, professors, they all have names that are trees, but that's not a tree name. Unless there is a mirror tree and I just don't know about it. So if there is, let me know. <laughs> Fun fact, I just learned this the hard way. You don't have to manually select every photo. They actually just have a button you can press and they select all the photos for you. So uh, yeah, 
I apologize for all of this extra time that we have to wait to figure out the process of rating each picture. When I was a kid, the Pokemon anime would end each episode with the Pokemon rap and they'd rap every single name of the Pokemon. And that's kind of what helped me learn how to say them correctly. But these are new Pokemon that were never in it. So I'm curious to see what I say wrong. The first Pokemon was Dodrio, then it was Vivian, then it was Florgis. Now it's Buffalant, which... I was even in that picture. I don't know. And how did I get two stars? That's the best one I've got so far. I, what? It's not even in there. Can you see Buffalant? He's literally right in the far back. I don't understand. See, look, that picture has more Buffalants in it than the other one. Okay, that's a Grookey. That's the easy one. He's the grass monkey, Grookey. If you played Sword and Shield, I picked Sobble. If you're curious, this is Badoof. He is a meme in himself. If you've never looked up Badoof memes, look at them. They're kind of funny. Good old Badoof. And I didn't get a good picture of him. That's weird. Okay. Wurmple. We got Wurmple. Wurmple is pretty cool. He's from third gen, which is like my favorite. Then we got Taylo, which I never think I say right. But Taylo, I don't think you could say it wrong, but it just never feels right. And then we got Swana, which there's two in this, which should be pretty good, right? And no, it's one star. But how did Buffalant, how is Buffalant better than, I don't understand. I really need to figure out how this works. We got Pichu, which is a little baby version of Pikachu. Good old second gen right there. Pichu, okay, so 500. Hoot hoot, it's its butt. I probably got a bad score because you can't even see it. And yeah, okay, one star. Am I going to get any other two stars? Come on, I need one more two star at least. Okay, two star, cool, okay. So... I don't know what is considered a good photo. I still don't understand. Okay, we're done. Let me know if there's any other games you want me to play with you. I would love to play Breath of the Wild just because I think that game shows you the kind of person I am when it comes to games because it's open world. So you get to create your own little adventure out of it. But let me know down in the comments. I'd love to read what you're interested in. And thank you guys again for checking this out. It's been fun.